Good day folks, this is Greg Judy, Green Pastures Farm. Today we're talking a little bit about uh, our tree swallow program. Um, uh, years ago, I guess I've been doing this about uh, 10 years now, we put up our first tree swallow house. That's what this is behind me. And people go, but Greg, why do you got a tree swallow house out here in the middle of your cattle pasture? Well, an adult pair of tree swallows will eat about 8,000 flies per day. Folks, that's huge. Um, I never saw a tree swallow around here until I put up a house. And so we fast forward to today, we've got 450 tree swallow houses out here now across Judy Farms. We've got 16 farms. We don't use any fly control. We're using the tree swallow houses, okay? Uh, this is made out of eastern red cedar. <clears throat> of course, we mill our own cedar. We sell eastern, eastern red cedar. We've got barns full of it. Um, you want your poles about seven feet tall and that birdhouse the way it works i'm going to show you it's pretty cool um you just pull you pull this out you reach in there pull the nest out put that back in folks you need to clean these out in the spring um late winter early spring you don't clean that birdhouse out and the new birds come in there's mites in the bottom of that nest, and we actually spray that out with a mixture of uh, bleach water, uh, one cup of bleach to two gallons of water. Just pull the nest out and spray that dude out. I don't like to clean out the nest in the fall, and I'll tell you why. There's bluebirds that use that thing all winter long, and they're warm in there. They're not nesting, they're just staying there warm. If you take the nest out in the fall, now you just got an empty box. So don't clean them out until the, about the end of February, you know, sometime in March. Go we'll through there and clean those out. But tree swallows, they're, they're a member of the, of the uh, barn swallow family, but they, they like it. They like it out here around your cows, okay? And they swoop, and they're like a miniature purple martin, but they feed on flies, okay? We don't need to be pouring all this crap on the back of our cows. Remember, anything you pour on the back of your cows ends up in the soil. It's killing your soil biology. You don't want to do that. Let's use some tree swallows. Go to your... Uh, Google tree swallows make sure you're in your home range before you go put some of these houses out I don't want you got to build a bunch of houses and they don't come but you can do that just go to the internet and find the tree swallow home range and that will show up for you thank you guys